Time to harvest potatoes. With God's help, of course. Yay! Potatoes. When you harvest potatoes, you want to make sure to get all the... Well, there's none on this one, but... Sometimes there's little, little potatoes on the ends that haven't formed. You want to make sure to get all of them out of the dirt that you can. And look for anything crusty like that. This one's pretty dried out, but you don't want to leave any of the, uh, the old crusty potatoes in the dirt because they'll, they'll cause disease and you'll have a potato famine. God forbid. You want to harvest when the soil's dry like this. Because it helps uh, helps keep the uh, potatoes from getting too scuffed up uh, when you dig them out of the ground. If the, if the soil's damp, the skin skin on the potatoes will be damp, and they they scuff easily, which is not good for long-term storage. Not bad. Another thing to look out for late in the season is the potatoes will grow close to the dirt, so if they surface, they can get some sunburn. If they turn green, you want to chuck them. They're not good to eat. They're, they get a, a, something that's toxic to human beings. Well, this one's not too bad. Probably won't throw it out. But you want to cover them with dirt if they start to surface like that. That's one advantage to uh, the really dark colored potatoes like these all blues. You can't really see. It's kind of crusty, but when you cut it open or wash it, they, they're uh, like a deep dark purple. They aren't as soft and buttery as Yukon Gold or something like that, but they store a lot better and uh, a lot more nutritious. Good for your body. Now that we have food for our bodies, we need to worry about our souls because they are starving to death. They are so emaciated. But most of us don't realize that until we start learning. Click a link, watch, watch a video. Save yourself and live a good life with God's help.